Thanksgiving, first and foremost, we live in this bit. Happy Thanksgiving. I love the numbers. Off into the sixes. Crazy. I just want to come on here and say what's up. It's Thanksgiving. My Thanksgiving's about to be lit. <laughs> he said the fact Tori had to go online and talk about it shows that he took it out. Hey, yo. Listen. Because I seen that, right? Every time, yo, every time this motherfucker go live, I'm not, I always miss the shit. I wish, I wish that when he went live, like I could have jumped on the fucking live or whatever. But according to um, ZZ Freestyle, like after he did his last shit, I was like, all right. And I was like, fuck it. So the Kodak Black beat, I, I was already going to do that. Like, even before this Tory shit, that was that was going to be my next freestyle. I was going to just go in over that shit. But then the Tory shit popped up, you know what I'm saying? And then I did my, my Liddy shit. But I've been having that ZZ shit in my head. That beat is hard as fuck. So I was already going to do the ZZ beat. The ZZ beat wasn't supposed to go. That was that was supposed to be just a Jordan Lucas freestyle, you feel me? And then... um. After I had to demolish the nigga on the uh, Liddy joint. And I don't give a fuck what he said. You put his Liddy shit against my Liddy shit. Like, it's you put those two against each other, nigga. It's, even though I went first and you had all the time in the world to listen to my shit and try to come with a better verse than me. If you put his verse on Liddy against my shit, it's not, you know what I'm saying? Like, everybody knows that my shit was better, period. You know what I'm saying? Period. That doesn't mean that Tory's not, you know what I'm saying? That doesn't mean that his shit was whack. His shit wasn't whack. It was cool. He had a couple bars in there, you know what I'm saying? He did his little research. It was cute, you know? Um, but I got so pumped up after I heard it because I was like, ooh, niggas want to rap. I. So then, again, like I've been telling you, like, the ZZ beat, that shit just been in my head. So I was like, fuck it. I'm going to shift the dynamics and I'm going to make it where it's not. You know, like I wanted to, I kind of wanted to change the vibe so that, like, you can play the shit at any time. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can play that shit in the club. You can play that shit. You know what I'm saying? So I wanted to shift the vibe. So I was like, fuck it. I'm just going to go in over the ZZ beat anyway. And I did the ZZ shit. Um, half of that shit, I, like, right after he, his shit dropped at, what, 11, 12? After he dropped this shit, I just went to work and started penning. So half of the shit up until the, uh, the baby the whole baby scenario, the father shit, and up into that part, the whole father shit on was all off the top. So it was all just, you know what I mean? But to me, I don't got no, me and Tori don't got no beef, nigga. Like, it's all rap shit, nigga. So at the end of the day, there's only so much you could really say about a nigga that you don't have beef with. You feel what I'm saying? If you don't got beef with a nigga, like, what the fuck I'm gonna say? Like, how many things is there to say about a nigga who don't got beef with that you actually are a fan of like there's not a lot of shit to say you know what i'm saying it's like it's like trying to get me to fight like my brother or something and me and this nigga don't have no problems it's like nigga I, how how bad you expect me to beat this nigga up you know what i'm saying like that's all i'm saying so if you listen to the zz and this nigga jumped <laughs> this nigga jumped on his live critique the shit live or whatever and um he told all his fans to go and comment corny emojis under my shit. So if you see a bunch of corny emojis, because Tori told him to do that shit, whatever. Um, but again, it's all hip-hop, man. It's all fun shit. Like, I already proved what I had to prove in Liddy, nigga. After that, we just having fun, nigga. It's like, you feel what I'm saying? Um, but that's all it's about, my nigga. Like, again, ain't no smoke between me and the nigga. Like, I fuck with Tori. We gonna make the record. It's gonna happen. Um, oh, and because I heard him say the part that I, on ZZ, when I said, how come you can't, um, you 
be a, be a, why you want to, um, you should, you should be like your father. Why, why don't you be like me? I'm a dancer or some shit. When I said that, I did some research on his father and his pops used to be a dancer. So when I was speaking from the perspective of that, I was speaking from the perspective of his pops. His pops was a dancer. You feel what I'm saying? And his pops wrote books. So when I was speaking on that, that's why I did that. You know what I mean? I wasn't no motherfucking dancer. I don't think his pops was a dancer like that. I think he was like a, like a, because it said he did choreography too. So it was like, not like a strip dancer. It was like a, you know what I mean? <clears throat> but apart from all that shit, fuck all that shit. Um, that shit was fun. And if there's any other rappers that want to get smoked, nigga, you already know. We can do this shit all day, you feel me? But yeah, this shit ain't, <clears throat> this shit ain't nothing. Congratulations, uh, over the fact that this is the, this is, what's dope to me is that what me and this motherfucker did is we kind of created a place where two motherfucking rappers nigga can go toe to toe on some friendly warfare shit and it not you know what i'm saying get to the you know get to a place where shit is like where shit gets fucked up so i think that i think that that shit is dope overall but um I, of course i still think tori ain't fucking with me lyrically you know it's not happening um musically he's a fucking he's he's dope and congratulations to uh you know for doing your thing G. I thought you was gonna be a lot worse than you were I'm gonna keep it 100 um but yo apart from that happy Thanksgiving you know I'm about to I'm about to put out some more shit this fan right here going crazy cause he seen me in my web hold on what's up what yeah I'm joining you guys Crib, bro. I live right down now. I was watching your live. I'm a big fan, bro. <laughs> Wait a minute. You ran all... How, you seen me... How you know the fuck where I was at? Because I saw it, and I live right down the street, and I see you driving by all the time. That's funny. That's crazy. So you ran all the way the fuck over here? Yes, you, bro. That's love, bro. Respect. Bro, I was listening to your disc this morning respect. and everything. What you thought about it? You fuck with it? Fuck with it hard. It's crazy. If you, you better come back with something hard. No, no, no. That's dead, B. It's dead. Me and Tori, we're not going. We're not... It's dead. It's dead? It's dead, yeah. It was never really, you know what I mean? It's yeah, dead, I It's cold out here. I'm going to give you a, come on. I'm going to give you a ride back to your crib. This nigga ran all the way the fuck over here. What's your name? Lewis. Lewis? Yeah. Lewis, respect, bro. Damn, nigga, put a coat on next time. But I literally, I just grabbed the first thing I saw, I took it and ran. <laughs> For my jeans, my jeans. God damn. That's love, though. Happy Thanksgiving, nigga. You too, bro. Happy Thanksgiving. What you gonna write, left? Right. You gonna see how far your ass ran. I could have been at any shards, though. This ain't the only shards. No, the only reason I know is I saw the home, how the sign looks. So, be honest, you I... You a real observant I, I, ass I, 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 nigga. I was like this. I was looking. And I, I was like, I think he's... I, think, I know he's from Worcester and stuff. But, like, I was like, I don't know. And then I was like, maybe he's at YC. Let me go to YC to check real quick. And I ran, and I saw the truck. I was like, yo, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy. That's love, though. Damn, you really ran. That's... Yeah, right, right there where those mailboxes are. Where, right? Right, right here. Right here? Yeah. You live in this crib? Yeah, this one right here. I play, I play football for Shrewsbury, so... Oh, where? So yeah. this ain't shit, yeah, no? Yeah, 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 no, no. Hey, yo, Hi. happy Thanksgiving. Thank Much you, love you to too. you, my man. Yeah. Respect, respect. See you, thank you. Yo. Damn. That's love. I think it said what's happening. What's happening is some fan realized that I was close to his crib. Because he seen where I was parked at. And ran over here just to come tell me that I demolished Tori. <laughs> Respect. Hey, but oh, oh, me and Chris Brown, hell yeah, me and Chris, me and Breezy got records in the can, bro. Uh, honey, me and me and him about to drop a, uh, another uh, another video. 
This shit don't stop, my nigga. This shit keep going. 2019 is fucking joiner season. Period. Period. 2019 is joiner season. It's crazy, my nigga. It's a hundred. You know what's crazy, too? I'm gonna talk on this shit. What's crazy is that... Like... Say that shit, no man. I'm gonna leave that shit alone. I'm gonna leave it alone. But yo, listen, happy Thanksgiving. Respect. And um I love I love you guys. Thank you for you know all the support. And um Just be on the lookout for the new for the newest shit.